Hi, I'm Kathy Wolfsfeld. I work with African American community out of the Calvary Baptist Church here in Salt Lake City, Utah. My focus mainly is on diabetes prevention, high blood pressure, and heart health. I was just a member of Calvary Baptist Church and I was approached by my pastor, Franz Davis, and he asked me if I would be interested in being a wellness coach. And that included helping women, specifically African American women, through their journey of diabetes and high blood pressure and obesity. And so we made SMART goals and we had a year long program with each person and saw the improvements by leaps and bounds. And so that really wet my whistle to continue. And so I've been going to the health department to be certified in diabetes prevention program. I have been certified in correctly giving blood pressure and how to interpret the blood pressure numbers. And so I've just been awakened in this field. And I love people and anything I can do to help someone, that, that's just my, my goal in life, my mission is to help. You know, they are so grateful because they're intimidated by the white coat. They don't want to say anything that is not right in the doctor's eyes. They don't want to contradict. They don't even want to question him. They just want to think, okay, well, he's a doctor. I'll do what he says. But then they don't really understand what he's saying. So that's where I come in, is to try to bridge that gap between medical and, and patient. And they are so grateful because they actually can understand and they know that I'm telling them the truth. I have a real life for instance for you. I went to the doctor with my brother. He is in end stage liver failure and has cancer. And his, his disease has progressed so that he doesn't remember things as well as he used to. And so I went in with my community health worker hat on so that I could explain to him what the doctor was actually saying. He was understanding things that were not even being said so I could, I saw that his disease was impeding his understanding of what was being told to him for treatments. And so I was there to reassure him and to um, break it down for him so that he could understand and he could retain what was said to him. COVID-19 has really shown a bright light on the disparities and on the underserved. The people that are underserved are at the bottom of the barrel. The health care that they have access to are usually last to get the PPEs. They're usually last when it comes to uh, medical breakthroughs. You know, they don't have the equipment, they're reusing disposable things and that's, you don't find that on the richer side of this, the aisle. And so just to bridge that gap, the, I'm just, I'm so passionate about equal access to health care for all because we're people, we are all human beings and we deserve it. It is our right to be taken care of as far as medical, we have the technology, we need to use it for everyone, not just those that have and not the have-nots.